Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peep game. All right, man. Same old Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. Undisciplined. No commitment to to boxing. To himself. To his family. Period. His name. Well, in case you guys don't know, he has a fight scheduled for, well, pretty much today. Versus Daniel Jacobs. And it was supposed to be at 168 pounds. But Julio Cesar Chavez doesn't make weight. He comes in at 172 pounds. Four pounds overweight. Now keep in mind, Julio Cesar Chavez has done this before. Not make weight. Basically don't, don't train seriously. And then he, he says this in every interview. He's committed. Oh, I'm committed to boxing. I'm, I'm committed. I, I, I'm committed. I, I, I'm going to fight hard and everything else. And then he don't do it. So, this is just textbook with him. You know, not taking his career seriously. And this is why a lot of people consider him a failure and a disappointment. Because, you know, when your father, who I have to keep. 100. I'm not very impressed with his father. I know. I'm hating. I'm hating. I know. I'm a racist. I know. All that. Because you know, like I said, you're not allowed to uh, you're not allowed by these dudes on YouTube. These YouTube uh, uh, internet mousepad mobster goons. You're not allowed to critique anybody that's not black. But yeah. Okay. But nevertheless, um, he just doesn't have what you call that commitment, and he's never had it. To me, I think he's a dude that basically has fought off his name, his father's name, and he's and, and that's the thing, though. He's another dude. If you look at his career, he don't really. What is his biggest win? I know. We all remember that that one sided ass whooping he took the except for the twelfth round that he took uh via Sergio Martinez in Las Vegas, I think, at the Thomas and Mack Center, and we all remember him getting destroyed by uh from Farah. So and we remember that fight, uh what's that dude's name? Sebastian Bach or whatever his name is, where he got hit in the face like 300 times and somehow some way they gave him the W. I hope that doesn't happen tonight. But I will be checking for that fight. Now, he had to pay like a million dollars to Danny uh Jacobs. I don't know what the weight is now, but he had to pay Daniel Jacobs like a million dollars. Now, keep in mind Daniel Jacobs um, has had a little bit of trouble like making weight sometimes. So he's fighting at 160. And we just want to see where Daniel Jacobs is, man, because that loss to Canelo, that was like really a downer. Because at times it looked like looked like he just showed up just to give up his belt, man. And that's pretty much it. Like, he sold his belt. I heard he got paid a substantial amount of money, but we'll never know. But, um, I'm going with probably Jacobs to win this fight and probably win this fight by late stoppage. Because I just don't believe in Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. And that's just my honest assessment. Gotta keep it 100. This your boy, Town Biz. I'm out.